Hey guys, welcome back to the Custom channel. It's Anderfell here. Uh, just in case you don't know what I look like. Hey, um, I'm basically doing a B-log, V-log, whatever the hell you want to call it. Um, uh, we're getting the Xbox One in three hours and six minutes, so I thought I'd show you guys an unboxing um, just before getting it. Um, maybe playing a couple of games on it and I'll send a sneaky to a few of my friends some footage so they can get out about early. But uh, I'm heading down to my uh, local EB Games, which is uh, GameStop. It's just renamed for Australia. I don't know why. It's like Burger King's called Hungry Jack's over here. It's the same thing, but you know. <laughs> so I'm gonna use me um, fast pass to get in the line quicker and hopefully get it back here quick for you guys to look at. So looking definitely forward to that. Um, still working hard on that uh, Christmas map. Um, no new updates really, it's just standard building. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it for that. So yeah, I'm going to uh, upload some um, footage of the Xbox One shortly after this video. Yeah, I'll show me going down and getting it, so it'll be pretty sweet. You've seen the lines and some, you can probably see what an Australian store looks like um, for a game store anyway. So anyway, I've rambled on enough. Um, I'll talk to you in a, in a bit, so yeah. Alright, um, I'm not allowed to film inside the store, so I would have try and sneak my phone in there, but um, what I got with the console so far is, um, you get, if that focuses, Non-focus. I get fever. Uh, it's like a code. I got uh, Battlefield 4. And uh, Dead Rising 3. Uh, it's about the size of a Blu-ray disc. Also got a uh, second controller on the charge and play. Now, um, that's the store over there, but um, I'm going to try and get in there and have a look. what's in it and um, I think I might just start with the games. Um, it was Battlefield 4, <clears throat> uh, which was right here. What's up here? I got um, the day one edition of it and I got um, a pack of dog tags. I don't know if I want those, am I giving them away or something? I don't think there's anything special in this. This and I'm pretty sure it's like the Xbox. Yeah, nothing special in there. Uh, that's Battlefield 4. Um, also on day 
you want to believe you get FIFA 14. I freaking hate sports games, so I'll definitely give that away. So anyone that misses out, um, tell me how much you wanted in the comments and I'll pick who I'd want to give it to. And I also got with a charge and play with an extra controller. Sort of thing. Um, the controller, it definitely feels smaller, and my thumbsticks are really tiny on it, but they might be too. And what did we get? Just want to see that. It's, it just looks like one of those little charge pack batteries, but instead of it being square and just clipping in, it looks like it. It actually looks like batteries, but it's got like a little computer chip in the front. So, I guess that's what they're going to use. Oh uh, yeah, on the back of the controller here, it opens up. I'm guessing it just slips and uh, slides in there like normal batteries. Also... Day one of Dead Rising 3. If you can see in the corner there. No, you can't see it. Well, in the center there it says day one. I don't know what's special about it, but I'll have a look, see if there's anything on the inside. Okay. Okay, again, it looks like a disc and just a book. And you get a three-day Xbox Live Gold trial. I'll, I'll give that away as well for someone that needs it. And now for Xbox Day One Edition. Um, I had two stickers on the front. One to hold this cardboard on, and then one to hold the lid on. And they're like really super sticky and really hard to get off. So I hope there is. Uh, there's no one on the bottom. First thing I see when opening it is the connect. <laughs> Looks really nice. Um, I don't see how it sits on your TV. But oh wait, okay, it's, it's adjustable, so you can uh, swivel it. I think you can clamp it to your TV, so you can see that. It does swivel, it's just a bit stiff. There's other stuff here. Oh, there's another section here. Um, it's got the, uh, like the, oh, sorry. Oh, and the sticker. You can put that on your skateboard or whatever. Uh, instruction, uh, instruction manuals. Um, how to charge it, and it's got one of those um, things you scan with your phone. There's an app. Same with this one, I think. I don't know what it is. Uh, day one achievement passcode. Um, I think you've got to scan it. And that's important. Um, headset. feels weird, but it's going to take some getting used to, and this kind of squeezes your head as it would. It's kind of brand new, so it's going to be all stiff. That's the headset. Very similar to the old headset. Um, I'm assuming this is the shit, day one controller. Uh, yeah, it is. See that's got day one written on it. Just kind of cool. Um, looking at 
this one, I think that this is chrome. This is made of chrome, like a metallic sort of thing compared to the normal controller. That's really cool. If he's missed out, I'm sure they'll be selling these on the net <laughs> for ridiculous amounts of money. Uh, Duracell batteries, I guess like Microsoft goes with Duracell. Um, not really much other power supply. Don't really need to see that. But, but, um, this is the power box, and it's very, very small. This is the uh, Xbox Slim's uh, one, and it's pretty much the same size as the Slim actually, it's just square, so it's fairly similar, if you can see that, so, it's got Xbox written on it, which is cool. Um, what else have I got? Alright, uh, comes with a little, comes with a little, uh, HDMI cable. See how long this thing is. So yeah, it's pretty long. Yeah, it's two meters. So you, this is actually longer than the one I bought. So that's really good, and it feels really sturdy too. Um, so it's got like a shelf that sits on top of the Xbox by the two. Let's get this bloody brick out. Sorry. Uh, stuck in there. It's got some tape on it. everyone carries on on the internet it's actually it's a good size it's it's a it's a good width like uh, lengthwise but it's a bit chunky going upwards but I'm assuming that's because it's got like a piece of a motherboard and shit in it and uh, that's pretty much it um I'm gonna do a separate video of actually playing with the uh, initial setup and stuff like that um, but yeah, this completes the unboxing, and sorry about the shaky footage, I wasn't allowed to film inside the store, but I tried to sneak it anyway. <laughs> so anyway, this is Anifel, thanks for watching the Dustcrafter channel, I'll see you next time.